first of all, I don't have candied peas and I like round red. So I'll be using two bags of round red. I'm going to put these to soak No, because I'll be making stupids. <laughs> so in my bag, I'm going to pour my peas in. After which, I'm just going to get some water to wash my peas. Now to my peas that is um, being soaked, I'm going to add a few cloves of garlic and I'm going to allow this to soak for, um, say, an hour before I put it on the stove to get it boiled. And that's my snack. I'm just snacking while I'm cooking. After the hour has passed, I'm just going to transfer my peas that is soaked into my pot to boil. Now, I don't know about you and how you cook, but to my peas, whether I'm cooking rice and peas, stew peas or whatever, I like to add a little seasoning to my peas to cook. This is just um, some thyme, escalion, garlic, um, pimento salt, and a little maggi. So make my peas taste flavorful, you know? I'm going to cover this down for about one hour or an hour and a half and have my peas well tenderized and ready for the next step. <laughs> So on to our meat, it's not vegan day, so we'll be doing pigtail. Come along with me. Making stupies with pigtail. I'm just going to wash and chop them up. So I'm just adding them to my basin. My bowl to stir up. I just need, I don't think I need all of this enough. But all right, three pieces. Just adding some vinegar No, and I'm going to wash these and chop them up and then I'll come back. So by now you know I, I like using garlic. So to some cold pipe water, tap water, I added my um, pig tail, the chopped wash pig tail. I'm just adding the garlic and I remove as much fat as I possibly could. This one looks like I could remove some more. But I'm just going to add this to the stove and allow it to boil. Because remember this was soaked in brine so um, it's a bit salty. So to remove some of the salt, we're going to boil this. Alright? And once you brought this to a boil, we're going to remove this water and get some fresh one because I add them to some fresh water. See all that fat degrees? So we're going to do this one more time. We're going to get some more water and boil them again to remove the excess fat and the salt. 